In this video, we'll downsize a sample so that it'll fit into an SEM with height restrictions. In this case, we'll make a sample that's 4 millimeters long by 3 millimeters wide. We will use the Lattice X 120 cleaving system with a magnifying lamp. You may also use the Lattice X 225 system or the Lattice X 420 system for this task. We will use Lattice Gear's small sample cleaving pliers to cleave the small samples. We'll first mark the sample with a Sharpie. The Sharpie marks clearly show the side for SEM examination as well as the lines for cleaving. Now that the sample has been marked, I'm going to transfer it to the lattice axe for indenting and then I'll cleave with the small sample pliers. Uh, and my marks very useful because I can position the sample such that uh, it won't be damaged. So now I'll position the indenter uh, for my first cut to, to uh, create the three millimeter sample. So you see the indenter and you see my line and the arrow. So now I'll indent is normal. So here is my indent. Now I'll use my uh, vacuum tweezers to pick up the sample. Uh, again, so I don't touch it. And from there, I'll grab it with uh, my tweezers. Uh, and there you see the sample. In the next step, I'll use the small sample cleaving pliers to cleave the sample. I know where I have made my indent, so I'll just Grab that edge with the indent. I'll take care not to touch the edge of the sample that will be analyzed in the SEM or other analytical tool. And here is my cleave sample uh, with the arrow pointing towards the edge that I'm going to analyze. Now I'll repeat this process by making an indent uh, at the trailing edge of the sample, the edge away from the edge I'm going to SEM, and then cleave that. Uh, that way I'm not touching uh, the, uh, the uh, edge that I want to keep clean. Now I've indented the second side, and now I'll cleave it. I'm going to hold the sample such that I can uh, put the pliers on the edge away from the the edge that I want to keep clean. So now I have the sample in the jaws of the pliers. I'm going to get close to the mat uh, so that I don't drop the sample. And there I have uh, another small sample with the edge that I want to put in the SEM, uh, never touched uh, by the tools.